Hello, and welcome to the ICC Mobus Master Tool Tutorials. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create an XML file which can be added to the tool as a new profile using the XML Manager. We'll use one of the example files included with the software as a template to do this. Let's start by navigating to the Example XML Files folder in the Tools Installation Directory. Next, we'll open the ICC profile example using Notepad. Before we make any changes, let's save this as a new file. We'll name it tutorialprofile.xml and save it to our desktop. The name of the file will be the name of the profile when it gets added into the tool. Let's take a look at the file. All XML files must be enclosed by the profile tag. Each file will contain an entry for the version of the profile. This is the string that will be displayed below the name of the profile. We'll leave this at what it is. If you'd like to use a custom icon for your profile, specify the icon's path relative to the file using the icon tag. If this tag is omitted, the default icon will be used. We'll use the default icon for this tutorial, so we can delete this entry. The rest of the file defines the register set. Each register entry is enclosed by the register tag and has an address, and optionally a value. If a value is not specified, the file will be treated as a template profile. For this tutorial, we're going to create a profile that will start running an inverter at 60 Hz. This is the Modbus register map for our inverter. To do this, we need to modify three parameters. The operation mode, which will set to network to tell the inverter to accept commands from the network. The running frequency, which will set to 60 Hz and we'll need to set the run bit in the control input instruction. Let's start by removing all but one of the register entries in our file. The first parameter we need to set is the operation mode. The register for it is 40,010, which means holding register 10. So we'll enter 10 for our first register's address. The value to set the operation mode to network is 14 in hex, which is 20 in decimal. We'll enter 20 for the register's value. The next parameter is the running frequency. The register for it is 40,014, or holding register 14. We'll just copy and paste our last register definition, and we'll enter 14 for this register's address. Because this register is scaled to allow setting the frequency down to a hundredth of a hertz, we need to multiply our frequency by 100. So, to run the drive at 60 hertz, we need to set this register to 6000. The last parameter we need to set is the control input instruction to make the inverter run. The register for it is 40009, which is holding register 9. Again, we'll copy and paste our last register definition and we'll enter 9 for our last register's address. The bit we want to set is the forward rotation command, which is bit 1. This equates to a decimal value of 2. So we'll enter 2 for the register's value. Finally, we'll make sure we save the file. If you'd like to learn about how to add the file we've just created to the ICC Mobbus Master tool, take a look at the tutorial on using the XML Manager. Thanks for watching.